Okay, this is test number five of a 7 kilowatt Colossus Outrunner motor. I'm trying to prove that I have found neutral timing for the internally mounted hall sensors. I'm going with the same basic setup from test number three, except I've added a pre-charge <coughs> resistor to the power wire to eliminate arc at plug-in. But to recap, for some of you that might not have been following along, I have a 84 volt um, battery pack hooked to a Lion 24 volt or 24 FET controller and I have the phase wires to start with I believe a clockwise direction. The wiring sequence from the motor hall sensors to the controller are as follows. Motor 1 to controller yellow, motor 3 to controller green, and motor 2 to controller blue. Alright, let's have a spin and see how it goes. Apparently we're set up in counterclockwise right now. Okay. Take up the full throttle. Okay, that's full throttle. That should be about 6300 RPM based on the KV of this motor. Okay, now I'm going to switch two of the phase wires and two of the hall corresponding hall sensor wires to see how it goes in the opposite direction. Sorry, this part's a little boring. Here we go. See how that goes. Give it a little throttle. Nice. Bring it all the way up to full throttle. 